Hey guys, welcome to the August 26th, 2017 edition of Hashtag This Day in Sports from A View from the Yard. I'm Rob Spear, alongside with my producer Cameron. Today we're going to share with you all the fun facts of interesting things that happen in sports this day in August 26, 2017. Don't forget, follow me right here below at Spear underscore Rob or at View from the Yard. I'm going to throw a challenge out to you because since we're on YouTube and YouTubers do this all the time, here's the challenge. I'm going to wait for a couple of seconds while you find me on Twitter at either right there, Spear underscore Rob or View from the Yard. And after you do that, throw a little comment out here. Say, hey, nice video or you stink, whatever you want. I don't really care. But if I can see that you have a comment out there, maybe, just maybe, I'll throw a shout out to you. So I'm going to pause right now and wait for that to happen. Alright, here we go. I know I do a lot of f uh, facts about the Phillies, but when you've been around since 1883, you have a lot of things that happen to you. Uh, unfortunately for the Phillies, most of them have been bad. Our first one is an example of that. The 1903 Phillies walk 17 Dodgers in a game. Good job, guys. At least you kept them from hitting the ball. Not surprisingly, they lost the game 3-5. to five. In 1939, the first Major League Baseball telecast was broadcast. Reds beat the Brooklyn Dodgers. Now, you can get every game on the radio, television, or streamed right into your phone. Wow, how far have we come? It's crazy. In 1947, on this day, we finally had our first black pitcher in Major League Baseball. His name, Dan Bankhead. He pitched for the Brooklyn Dodgers from 1947 to 1951, after playing for the Birmingham Black Barons and the Memphis Red Sox from 1940 to 1947. He had a 385 batting average while down there, and also his very first at bat in the majors, home run. How many people get to say that? And on for that matter, how many pitchers today would we get, be able to say their very first hit was a home run? Not very many. Going back to hits, in 1985, Baltimore Oriole Eddie Murray knocked in nine RBIs in a game versus the California Angels. They went on to win that game 17-3. And last but not least, today in 1991, Kansas City Royal Brett Saberhagen no hits the White Sox and wins the game 7-0. The Royals went on to hit 13 times that game which is a lot, considering the other team hit zero. Okay, that's it for now. Don't forget to follow me on Twitter right here, at Spear underscore Rob, or at View from the Yard. And until I see you tomorrow, here is my producer, Cameron, wishing you a happy birthday, if today is your birthday. Hi, I'm Cameron, and if your birthday is today, August 26th, well, happy birthday to you. You can share your big day with the following people. 1894, Sparky Adams, 1909, Jean Moore, 1924, Alex Kellner, 1961, Jeff Parrott, 1964, Chad Krul Kruter, 1969, Ricky Batalico. <laughs> 1975, Morgan Einsberg. 1980, Brendan Harris. Happy birthday! Poised down!